pattern solving issue so what uh, this is a problem that uh, how to print a certain pattern in python so today we are going to look at that that how to print a pattern in python and so this is called famously known as the pyramid python uh, pyramid pattern so over here what happens is as you go down the line the number of stars keep on increasing and this is how it looks so giving you a tutorial i would like to show you how it looks so in this pattern first i'm going to show you what is the type of pattern and later i'll explain you how it is done so this is basically the pattern 1 2 3 4 5 6 and this is based upon the number of lines the number of lines and that would be the number of stars that would get printed so let's see how it works so first i'll draw for explanation i'll draw the number of uh, stars over here to give you a brief so first uh, we divide it into then two stars two and three stars one two three and four okay so these are the four stars and if you see over here these are divided into lines so this forms a sort of an excel sheet you can say and what in this I am trying to show you is like first what I does it and what each and every element does it I'll explain you and so over here as you can see there's one so in the first row there's one second two third three fourth four so as you come down the line the number of stars keep on the number of stars keep on increasing so this is how it works and let's see how the code works over here so let's see so coming to the tutorial back to the our practical part so for over here we will be using a for loop first we will define n so you can take either take the input value so I will take the input value first so this would tell us enter the number uh, of lines okay so this would be an in input now next we would see so we can define n uh, earlier before that suppose we want to take five lines uh, and now let's use the for loop to defining the function for uh, for taking for i in range and this would be we want to print it the number of lines uh, plus one and uh, for j in range so this would take us the number of i's and as the number of i increases the uh, number of as i have told you earlier as number of stars would also increase so 
this would include what do we want to in, uh, print we want to print the stars so we print the stars and uh, since and we are going to use end with so and in the next we are going to print empty okay and uh, now let's see if it works so as you can see over here one two three four five yeah so we have five stars over here according to the range uh, according to our number like we wanted five stars and five star who gets printed so this I'll tell you how it works it basically works like over here first it comes to n so n is like one over here zero over here it starts from zero it goes over here so it starts from zero so uh, j is zero so nothing it doesn't enter the loop so back comes above one so then one then one over here it starts from zero so it, it runs zero one times one times and the star gets printed then again it comes over here so then over here in the above section it becomes 1 i becomes 2 then it comes over here so 0 1 2 0 1 and 0 times and the first time so twice it gets and then it comes above and similarly then it goes 3 over here so 3 gets done and the value gets incremented over here then it comes to 4 so 4 times and then we have 5 so if in case we had only n then you would observe that this won't get as 5 but only 4 of them because the fifth line won't run and that would you know terminate earlier as uh, compared to the one it should run so that is the point that it would terminate so that's that needs to be kept in point uh, in mind while uh, you know developing such patterns in the coming up video uh, i'll be you know giving you a brief about how these work and some more patterns for this video thank you